Today, we're going to dive into an all-in-one AI tool that integrates powerful video generation models like Google VO3, Vita 2.0, One 2.2, and Halo 2 all now available for free within the Edimaker software. Pay close attention to the videos created with the VO3 and One 2.2 AI models. They are truly excellent and can be used to make professional films and animations. Stay with me as we explore exactly which powerful models this tool offers and which AI features we can utilize. As always, I'll start with Google and search for Edimaker AI. The first site you see is the official Edimaker website, so I'll click on that. This is the homepage. It provides a lot of details about this editing tool and its AI capabilities, such as AI image to video, AI talking avatar, AI clip maker, and many other special features. You can do a lot of work editing your videos and utilize the AI features within it. To start, I'll hit the login button at the top. You can log in with your Gmail account or your personal email. I'll use my Gmail account. Once you enter the application, you can see from the top section how many features, AI tools, and video editing options it provides. A key point is that it is available for both Mac and Windows operating systems. I've already done a general overview of the software and uploaded that video. I'll put the link in the description and the top card so you can check out that general review as well. In this specific video, we're going to focus on using its AI video generator tool. I think this will be incredibly useful for you, so let's check it out together. Now, I'll click on the AI video generator. We land on this page. After signing in, you see the details about its video generator. It explains that in addition to creating AI videos, you can also use it as a full video editor to perform any edits on your clips. To download the software, we click on this option. As you can see, it downloads directly. We hit the Save option here. Then, we run the installer. In the open window, you just need to click the Install button and wait for it to finish. It installs easily and quickly. Since I've already installed the software, I won't go through the installation process again. After installation, it opens the application automatically. Here, it shows us the same tools we saw on the website, which you can now use within the editor. To start, I'll sign in using the same Gmail account I registered with. After signing in, you are taken directly to this section where you can see you have 30 credits. Clicking on Increase Credit opens this page, showing us the paid plans. You can purchase either the monthly or annual plan. For only $50, it provides a ton of features, which I think is more affordable than tools like Premiere, but with the added benefit of having numerous AI tools built right in. Let's go back to the software. On the left, under the template section, you have access to a huge collection of ready-made templates. All the trending videos you see on Instagram or TikTok are gathered here, and you can achieve a professional edit simply by replacing the existing images or videos. Now, let's move to the best part of this application, the AI tools. Just look at how many tools are available. It offers extensive features for modifying video, audio, images, and text all powered by AI. Because I want to use its AI video generator tool, I click on this option. After clicking, we arrive at this page. This is the software's working environment. As you can see on the left, there are many video tools you can use. In this video, I want to use its text-to-video tool. We click on the text-to-video option. At the top, we click on Model. You can see many famous and professional AI tools that are being talked about these days, such as Google VO3, Want 2.2, Vita 1.5, Halo 02, and two excellent native models for the software itself, Edimaker 1.0 and 2.0. First, I want to use Google VO3, so I click on it. In this section, you can write your prompt. It can also convert an image into a prompt or your text into a detailed prompt. Here, you can set the duration, which is available in 4, 6, and 8 seconds. In this part, 
you can select the quality between 720p and 1080p. And here, you can choose the aspect ratio. I have a pre-written prompt that I will paste here. I'll set the duration to 8 seconds, the quality to 1080p, and select one output. By checking this option, we can tell it to also generate sound for our video, as you know the VO3 version produces audio as well. Now I click Generate and wait for our video to be created. It takes about 1 to 2 minutes for the video to be generated. Our video is ready. Let's watch it together. It was truly excellent the quality, the scenery, the audio, and even the sunlight, capturing that 70s cinematic style and quality perfectly. Now, I want to use the WAN 2.2 model. Here, you can see it gives us a warning that our prompt is too long. I'll change it. The duration is only 5 seconds, and we choose 1080p quality. I'll also leave the aspect ratio at 16 to 9. Now, we click Generate and wait for the video to be made. The video is finished. Let's see it. Both models are truly outstanding, they created this video beautifully and perfectly showcased the vintage 1970 Dodge Challenger. Both made professional, cinematic videos. Now, I'll move on to my next prompt to create another video. I paste my next prompt here. I select the Google VO3 model and, with the same previous settings, click Generate and wait for the video to be created. The video is ready. Let's watch it together. This is absolutely incredible. It looks like a commercial or a cinematic clip. It's so easy to make a film using this version. Now, I want to try the exact same prompt with the WAN 2.2 model. I paste the prompt here again and click Generate with the same previous settings. The video is ready. Let's watch it. This image is also truly stunning. Just look at the car's reflection on the water it's created so vividly and realistically. Now, let's see if we can create an animation with these models. This time, in the prompt area, I click on Text to Prompt. You can write your request briefly, and by clicking the side arrow, it converts it into a professional prompt. I will write my request like this, the fox and a robot standing on a cliff and watching the birds fly, Disney Pixar style. I click the arrow and wait for the professional prompt to be generated. It created my prompt. Now, in this section, we click Confirm. From here, you can refine your styles and prompts, such as color, style, lighting, and whether it's realistic or anime style. I included everything in the prompt already. Note that your prompt must be under 800 characters. I'll delete the extra part. With the same previous settings, I click Confirm. Our animation is created. It's absolutely stunning. It made it so interestingly and perfectly in the Pixar style for us. From the right side, you can change the style, expand it, increase its size and quality, or regenerate if you wanted to create a new video. I will copy the same prompt from this section. I set the model to Google VO3 and paste the prompt here. I select 8 seconds, 1080p, 16 to 9 ratio, and check the Generate Audio box. We click Generate and wait for the video to be created. Let's see how it turned out. Ooh. 
I think VO3 really excelled in this case, creating the animation perfectly. It even showed the emotion of the robot and the fox, and turned it into a video with beautiful music. We can create narrative animations for ourselves using continuous and story-driven prompts. Now, the videos we created have a plus sign in the top right corner. When you click on it, the video is added to the timeline. You can rearrange the videos. You can also select transitions from here. For example, I'll select this one, let's see it together. There are many transitions here that you can drop between two videos, just like other video editing software. After all the edits we've made to our video, you can click export from the top right. From here, you can upload directly to social media and YouTube. And from this section, you can export it to your personal system. By clicking this option, we specify the location on the system. It exports as MP4 with 4K resolution, and you can also separate and export only the audio from here. Now, by clicking the export option, we generate the output. It does this very quickly and at a high speed. Let's watch the exported version together. I only did this as a test. I highly recommend you use this software. It's a comprehensive tool for all video editing tasks. In addition to video editing, you can also use its image generation tool, which includes powerful models like Stable Diffusion 4 and Nano Banana. I don't think there's anything more powerful than these. Alright, dear friends, I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. I'd be happy if you like my video and subscribe to my channel. Take care of yourselves. Love you, goodbye.